Hi guys, welcome to How Do That channel. My name is Anthony. Today I'm going to show you how to make salted fish fried rice. Okay, so to make this um, salted fish fried rice, we're gonna need one pomelo dry salted fish. If anyone that, uh, you can buy this on an Asian supermarket or any supermarket that has salted, dry salted fish. This is the fish that I made up myself. Um, if you wanna, if you wanna learn how to make this uh, pomelo dry salted fish, you can see the description below. I have the link that I um, show you how to make this pretty fast, pretty easy. It has a lot of um, vitamin B1 and B12, also vitamin A. You can use, you can pretty much dry salted any kind of fish, but I, I think uh, pomelo is really good. It has less bones and it has a lot of fattenings, and you want that it taste, it make it taste really good. For vegetable, you're gonna need some cabbage. Cabbage is very chewy and very crunchy so it's really good for fried rice okay you're gonna chop it to small slices we're gonna chop the garlic to small pieces and then we're gonna chop the fish into small pieces too we don't use the whole fish we only use uh, maybe a quarter of, uh, of the fish so i forgot to mention that we also need some rice now we chop the fish and we cook the rice. Okay, so we gotta heat up the pans and you're gonna add some olive oil or any kind of oils that you prefer to. And then you saute the garlic. Make sure you use a lot of garlic. Okay, so we're gonna saute this to be browns. You're gonna add a little bit of sugar because garlic has a taste, so um, you add a little bit of sugar. It's the trick that to make the garlic to taste better. Right, so we're gonna save some of these at the end when you sprinkle it on top of the fried rice. So we're gonna save some of these. All right, so now we're gonna add the fish. Okay, so make sure that you want the fish to be golden brown. The fish itself is really salty, so you wanna add some sugar, a lot of sugar. This depends on how your taste, but usually the fish itself is really salty. All right, so we're gonna add some rice in it. And make sure to mix them together really well. So we're gonna cook this for about a minute or two. And then we're going to start adding the eggs. Make sure you scramble the eggs, not too cooked. Okay, now we'll mix the eggs and the rice and the fish together. And now we add the cabbage vegetable in it. So we cook for about a minute or two. You don't want the cabbage to be really cooked um, to keep it crunchy. Okay guys, so you're gonna sprinkle in a little bit of garlic that we fried them earlier. add some scallions on top and voila this look beautiful it smell wonderful 
and let me see how it tastes. Mm. Oh my. The garlic makes so crunchy. The fish, just right. Because the sugar, I don't taste any salty anymore. Alright guys, that's it. If you like this video, please subscribe. Give it a thumbs up. If you, if you have any comments or questions, please write it on the comment sections. I will add a link of how to dry salted fish. And I hope to see you again. Mm. Mm -hmm.